Hi everybody, this is Father Warner D'Souza. Today I begin a new series talking about some of the artifacts from the Archdiocesan Heritage Museum. This museum, which we built from practically nothing, has today become and taken the pride of place in the Archdiocese. The Archdiocesan Heritage Museum is situated within the building of St. Pius X College in Goregaon. Today I want to talk to you about chalices and in particular a chalice. Etymologically taken from the Latin word calyx, a chalice represents a cup and it occupies the first place among the sacred vessels. It serves to contain the consecrated vine. The earliest specimen was the chalice of Cheles in the year 659 AD, preserved until the French Revolution. Over the years, the chalice has evolved in form, material and decoration. The collection of the Archdiocese and Heritage Museum includes a variety of chalices. However, one of the most beautiful and significant among them is this chalice. We take a closer look at this masterpiece, dating back to the mid-19th century. This chalice is about 32 centimeters long and has a diameter of 20 centimeters. It is fashioned in gilt metal. Shaped as an inverted bell, the cup is ornately embellished and gilded. You can see here a rope border surrounds the edge of the four cup. Then you have four pairs of acanthus leaf curls outward and conjoin at the tips creating a simplified heart reserve. These are adorned as you can see with four cherubs. Suspended below the cherubs is a decorative acanthus bud. The Acanthus spinosus is a Mediterranean plant with notched leaves. It was used as a stylized ornament in Greek and Roman architecture since the 5th century BC. In Christian art, it symbolizes everlasting life. Now, I want to show you the opulent stem, which holds four separate pillars, each with a wealth of decoration. They serve as an indirect representation of the four evangelists. A protruding cushion knob separates the stem from the pyramidoid base. Cylindrical at the upper end, the base flares outwards into multi-lobed foot. The base of the chalice is patterned as an inverted lily. A sequence of shamrock motifs ornament the edge of the base like an upright fence. Encircling the base are reserves fe featuring the cross of the Order of Christ. These are alternated by high relief images of the Blessed Virgin Mary, of Jesus and of St. Joseph. Mr. J. Alfaro Porto, a French artist, fashioned this chalice as affirmed by the inscription on the reverse of its base. I do hope you enjoyed watching this video. Do share it with your friends as we share our faith with one another. God bless you.